Okay everybody, this is just a little heads up just to let you know the sort of kind of things you're going to be needing for this expedition. First and foremost you're going to need a surface to paint on, that's your paper here. I buy it very thick, um, but just make sure you get watercolour paper, alright? I buy it in sheets, big sheets like this and carve it out, it means I can do bigger pictures, smaller pictures. So I buy mine in single sheets, okay? Mine's very thick, I think it's 300 pound, 640 gram. I've, I've I explained this in the videos, but it holds the water really well and it doesn't buckle and cockle. Um, because it's so fat, you don't have to stretch it, which is a pain, to be quite frank. It doesn't always work. Secondly, but you're only as good as your surface, remember that, okay? Next, you're gonna need your paints. I use tubes. I might use pans for outside sketching, you know, um, but indoors I always use my tubes because they come out a lot fresher, um, meatier, more muscular, juicier. Um, I use all different types. I'm not going to... I would go to the art shop and get some proper, you know, some proper... This is student's quality, the big old long ones like that. These ones is an artist quality. Just get the best you can, but buy a tube at a time, one or two tubes at a time. To be fair, I'm not going to preach to you about what colours to use, that's your decision. That's your job, that's your office as the artist. I can't tell you what colours you like, so you use your own colours, okay? To begin with, I'd suggest maybe three brushes, um, one, this is a sort of size nine, just off the shelf, Not I don't use sable because I paint quite strong. So these are all man-made, they're, they're pretty cheap um, things. A triple O, I've got there, and a four. Anything this sort of size, or twice the size of that, or anything smaller, can be executed with these three brushes, okay? That's that, that's the pencils. You, I like to work on an open palette like this, so as I've got lots of space to mix and move. I don't like the little compartmentalised things, not my cup of tea at all. You'll need some water, clean water, ovs and make sure you have a rag, very important part of the equipment. Basically, you're ready to go. With this kit, you are ready to go. So, off you go, and let's get painting. 